Hayden really gets the VIP experience right now. Alright, we have bad news. Katie made the biggest Disney faux pas there is. Cutest waitress I've ever employed. Uh, we've changed like that. Very fun. And my favorite part of the ride is that we don't have to wait. Alright! It is 5.55 in the morning. We are at Walt Disney World. We are staying at the Animal Kingdom Lodge, which you can't really tell much right here, but I'm just gonna tell, show you. Oh, sugar. I'm gonna zoom in. We are looking over the savannah and there's some animals this morning. I don't know what they are, and it looks like a painting because they're standing so still, but I promise you they're real live animals. It is 6.30 and that's our meeting time. Everybody, all of our creators, are joining out here. I'm so looking forward to meeting some of the creators today because we just got here yesterday and we didn't get a chance to meet many people. So hopefully we get a chance to meet here. Maybe this way. We get a chance to meet some people today and create with them, which is so darn fun. We just met the lands and we just met the binums. Oh, oh baby? Got a right oh, okay, very good. I'll go check in. He didn't really get the VIP experience right now because the park isn't even open, <laughs> and we're about to walk down Main Street. <laughs> and you know how we are about Main Street. And usually it's crowded. It's usually it's crowded, crowded, and crowded, and it's a full-on sprint <laughs> to Mine Train. But instead, we have it to ourselves, which is crazy. How excited she is. Isn't she cute? This is every Disney thing. Aww. Okay, that's not cute. <laughs> if you're gonna do, do a little skip or something. <laughs> She's galloping. Stop running, lady. All right, you guys, we are Why here. Are look at it. I know, because so I can see everybody. <laughs> you guys, look at it. There's only us, like the creator group. Here in the Magic Kingdom, I know, it keeps is, it being last to everything. I know because we're doing all this stuff. All right, back in beelining it for the castle. <laughs> so back in our cast member days, Mike and I were just talking about how fun it was to be here in the well. We would work early in the morning, and it was really fun. I said the drive down the highway to get here was always dark and not that fun, but once you got here, it was this whole different like. A whole different world, right? Very nice. Super duper fun. And I love being in the park in the morning before people get here. Right. At night, after it closes, is cool too. But the morning, there's just something special. Great light. Yes, something special about the morning. It? It's gorgeous. Look at that. Oh my gosh, you guys, Main Street, USA. Just like the old days. <laughs> okay, one of the best things we do at Disney is eat. And this morning, they have a creator's breakfast for us. So we're at the Tomorrowland Terrace which is right by the castle, and we're eating. And we found this amazing dessert table. So they're, okay, again, it's the 50th, 50th anniversary celebration of Walt Disney World, which opened in 1971. And so they have all these special events and special, like the castle special, and the Mickey and Minnie have the special costumes on, and they made special desserts and special food for the 50th anniversary. So we're gonna show you, it's ridiculous. Michael, would you like to take us through? <laughs> I know. I, I, Meg, oh Hi, my you? gosh, fantastic. Can you please tell us about this thing first? Yeah, of course. So this is called our Happy Haunts Milkshake. It's themed after Haunted Mansion. So it's a blackberry and vanilla milkshake with a chocolate donut on top. And you can see that we use the um, the Haunted Mansion wallpaper for the Oh here. my gosh, yes. It's super adorable, right? Oh my gosh. Does one person eat that? Just one? Or do people split that? I wouldn't split it, would you? <laughs> I, I mean, don't, honestly, we I do don't split know. it. It's beautiful. <laughs> More Haunted Mansion, you got, oh my gosh, those this are... This is um, called the Chilling Chamber Pop. So as you can see, the chocolate piece has the artwork from the stretch portraits that are inside the Haunted Mansion. So actually when we sell this, the chocolate piece just pushed down further because this is an actual push pop. So oh, push yes! Pop up, you see the whole chocolate piece come out of it. That is genius. Yeah, that is really... This one is and the little beep, eyes. Beep, you see the eyes. It's a quicksand portrait. So it's just got graham cracker crumbs in there, some vanilla cake in there. It's pretty tasty. You can find this at Sleepy Hollow right now. Okay. Oh my gosh. So awesome. All right, you guys, look at that hot dog. I have no idea what's on that. What is that? It's strawberry? A strawberry and bacon jam. So it's honestly a hot dog that's mimicking a Monte Cristo. <gasps> 
Oh my gosh. And where can I get that? This that is at the Plaza restaurant, so right over on the corner there. Okay, that is one of my favorite dishes ever. Look at Steamboat Willie. Ryan, that's a Monte Cristo. You know you love your Monte Cristos. Oh you get it at the Plaza restaurant. And look at the hamburger. I love that. Oh my gosh, this is so great. Thank you so much. What a pleasure. This is so fun. Good morning. We just had an amazing breakfast. By the way, Disney food is some of my favorite food in the world. Uh, my favorite meal I've ever had was at Disney. My favorite breakfast is Disney breakfast, and that's what we just had. It was insane. Including Mickey waffles. Including All the Mickey, Mickey waffles. waffles you can eat. So good. Anyway, now we're going to our own exclusive. Okay. So they open the park early for members or for. People who are uh, uh, Disney guests, exactly. like Disney so they, hotel guests. Exactly. So they opened the park early for Disney hotel guests, like people that stay at the resorts. So they get to go to Tomorrowland, I think, right? Uh -huh. They only get to go to Tomorrowland. We, I think we're going to go across the frontier land, and we, us creators, get a land all to ourselves just to explore and do the rides. And I can't wait. It's going to be so much fun. We've done, we, think, we think it's Liberty Square, maybe, in yes. Frontierland? We've done stuff like this before, but um, never at Disney, so I'm so excited. Let's go. <laughs> All right, we have bad news. What's missing? My bag. Ryan's in. backpack. We think he left it at our breakfast. Yes. Yes. He's not, not very good at keeping his stuff. One of our favorite parts of the Magic Kingdom are these beautiful murals depicting the story of Cinderella underneath Cinderella's castle. Mike, would you like to tell us a little story about this that you know? A little history. Uh, detail in this mural and in the story they say the stepsisters were red with rage and green with envy. If you check. Red with rage and green with envy. And the wicked stepmother. Very nice. A lot of cool stories about this. Yes. Yeah, we'll leave for you. Enjoy your ride. Oh, we'll take the popcorn though. We'll fill it up. Let's go. Bye, guys. Brian and I just read. Oh, nice. Just rode the Woodway People Mover. Great ride. Right now it's just called the People Mover, but tomorrow in Transit Authority. When I was here, it was the Woodway People Mover. It's still the Woodway. We still call it. Disney before it was Disney was called Wed for Walter Elias Disney. Nice. Surprise your folks from that fact. And that ride is one of Brennan's favorite rides. He yep. took a picture and sent it to him, and he was like, "People mover!" He was so excited to hear that we were on that. All right, Katie, or yeah, Katie and Katie, bring up there. We're gonna eat some 50th anniversary popcorn and wait for them. Sound good? Huh? <laughs> Katie made the biggest Disney faux pas there is. She wore heels to the parks. Now to Katie knows pictures. better to get so pictures. Fun. She knows better than to do that. But anyway, that is a okay. We are headed out. To be fair, I thought we were just going to be here for breakfast. Right, so. right. So we're going to head out, you guys. We're going to go. We're going to leave the Magic Kingdom, go back to our spectacular hotel, spend some time there, and then go to the Animal Kingdom back. later tonight. Let's go. I know. I <laughs> By know. the way, what? come to the parks early. Cause it's 11.30, and it feels like 2 o'clock. I know. I feel like we've done so much. Like, it's great. Yes, it is great. I totally Maximize agree. your time at Disney. Yeah. I know the Disney beds are amazing, but, right, but get sleeping, up in the There's water. no sleeping in at Disney. No sleeping no in. Sleeping it's in. rise and grind time. That's exactly right. At the end, you know I lick your nose. <laughs> but they're awesome. That's easy way to do it. So great. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, give us a dollar. <laughs> and many more. <laughs> Guys, no, nobody's moving. I have no dollars and no cents. <laughs> That's the Dapper Dan. We love the Dapper Dan. M I C K E Y M O U S E. Hey guys, this is great. Yep. Yep. But let's jazz it up for the folks, right? Okay. Okay.
worked here at Disney. I worked right there at City Hall on Main Street, USA. I was a guest relations hostess. It's not where I met Mike though. I worked there after I met Mike. I met Mike when I was a food and beverage server at Dixie Landings Hotel. Cutest waitress I've ever employed. Aww, thanks, Mike. So when you were at guest relations, basically if you were having a bad day or someone missed every ticket, you got a present. You got to go see mom. You have to Jill go see Donnelly, me. And she would make your day better. That, that was my intention. I tried to make yes. everybody's day a little bit better. We thought you worked attractions in Tomorrowland. And then I went, and jobs. then I went to food and beverage where I met food your dad. And then I went to guest relations. And I gave VIP tours and regular oh, tours yeah. and took care way, of yeah. any issues. Fun little thing. I don't know if we already said this. Bill Russell, 11-time NBA championship, NBA champion, you gave him a tour. Yes, I was his little, tour guide. Little 5'1", yeah. Joe Donnelly <laughs> gave 7'1", I don't even know how to tell you. <laughs> Bill Russell, a tour of Disney. Yes, he was, I had him for three days and we toured yeah. around. I toured a lot of fun people. That's fun. A lot that's of fun. famous people. So yeah, that's a little bit of that. Yeah. Mike, you worked on Main Street USA? Yes, absolutely. Yes? I worked on Main Street USA back in the day. I was uh, guest relations kind of host. <laughs> okay. We have a little competition on who was actually more of a big deal. Who knew? Actually, Dad, Mike was more of a big deal than me. <laughs> Definitely. He went through the management development program, all that stuff. So that's our Disney experience. Oh, look at that monorail. Do you see that monorail? Oh, it's all decorated for the 50th. All right, you guys, we're going to ski down and go back to the pool, relax a little bit, and then come back to the animal kingdom. Stay tuned. We are out here on our balcony. We just came back from the Magic Kingdom for a little R and R before we go to what the if, Animal Kingdom. What if the I don't think we need to go to the Animal Kingdom, if, Katie. What if they we just look right way? out here. What if they came this way and like, like, just looked at? They those. could. I think they could. They could watch people change. Yeah. Which is rude. Well, I mean, what if they're, they're drafts? I'm so glad we came back. What are you going to do? Are you going to eat? He's thinking, he's thinking, he's thinking. Is that water in that blue? In that blue? Oh, yeah, there's water. He's like, mm. Mm. Oh, my gosh. Hey. <laughs> Can you hear me? We've changed like that. Now it's time for us to go to the Animal Kingdom. There's our bus right there. Animal Kingdom. So we're gonna go over there. The, the Disney has an amazing dinner set up for us, a group dinner. Mike's gonna join us in, in a few minutes. Oh, we gotta get it filled. We are about to enter Animal Kingdom for the evening. We're pretty excited because we're told that the animals come out in the morning and in the evening. Of course, we've seen a lot of animals already at our hotel. Yeah, but if we do park. a safari, I do too. I, love this park so much. I do too. And it's just nice being here. Like, yeah. I like doing the rides and it's fun, but I would just walk through. Like, I. No, totally. I'm fine without the rides. Honestly, um, this is the best scenery park. Totally. Totally. Oh, is that the same? That is cool. Yes, it is. Look at that. that is just, that's totally made out of sand. There's little bears. That is cool. Polar bear. Our Animal Kingdom outfits are much different than our Magic Kingdom outfits. We forgot to do Outfit of the Day with Magic Kingdom, but you can imagine. I mean, well, you could just rewind. Can just see, yeah. <laughs> see what we had. Okay, so let's go Kaden first. Kaden, Outfit of the Day, what you got on? A white shirt. White balls. Some khakis, kind of. And some flip flops with the dogs out. Turn around. Grand Canyon. Grand Canyon. And a hat. And a hat. You're looking safari-like. Thank you. We went for safari theme this time. Okay, Katie, hold on, turn around. Bye. I got my hat from mommy. I got my earrings from mommy. Um, I did my hair and piggy tails. And I got this dress from Target and this belt from Target. And I got these things a long time ago and they're actually my work shoes, but they look safari so, <laughs> so that's the vibe. That's it. Yeah, can I do a little picture? Yes, time for you. Alright. So yeah, this little shirt, I love it. I'm wearing it unbuttoned right now. It's like green, it fades into this nice cool gray. Anyway, white t-shirt underneath, a little belt, khaki shorts some white shoes, whatever. Got some uh, decorative, you know, I thought these bracelets were kind of, you know. Oh yeah, that's bit. very and safari. And then the necklace to end it off. You know, it gives it that kind of the, the green and brown Earthy color. kind of vibe. Earthy kind of vibe. I got, kind of vibe. I got you. I got you. Okay, yeah. all right. Safari outfit on. It's sort of a half safari, half theme park outfit. I got my hat that actually was Katie's and she didn't want it anymore, so I have it. 
favorite. Nice. My favorite hat. And then I got this that I just got when we were in Key West. I got it at Ron John's Surf Shop in Key West. Louder. Sorry. I got this at Ron John's Surf Shop in Key West when we were there. I don't remember where I got this. I think I might have gotten this at like TJ Maxx or something a couple of years ago. And then of course I have my, um, what are these called? Birkenstocks. Birkenstocks. I have my Birkenstocks on. And, oh, this is, I got this in Hawaii when Mike and I went to Hawaii a few years back, several years ago actually. And my earrings are just regular little studs. Am I missing anything? No, I don't think so. Yeah, what's your bag? Oh, this is my bag. Nice. This is a bag. If you didn't watch yesterday's vlog, this is part of the swag. Nice. It's a cute little leather Mickey backpack. Perfect. So we're very excited. I have to say, I hope that we're going to get to see Divine. If you guys know who Divine is, it's one of my favorite things right. of the animal kingdom. Yeah. She is a very long vine and she walks on stilts and she hides in the trees. So I'm hoping right. to see Divine. All right. Animal kingdom, baby. Let's go. It's not funny because Ryan's kind of upset about it, but he just got pooped on by a bird. Got pooped on by a bird. What a <laughs> Which, horrible situation. I tried to tell him it was good luck, but he I said he doesn't care. Say, Who splashed water on me? Then I see this bird fly over. I check my arm, and it's just brown streak. That was that was a horrible experience. <laughs> I did say it was like in my hair and everything. Oh, oh. We are we are at the animal kingdom, but I don't know how close. I mean, it is up close with the animals, right? I'm not sure you want to get that close. I don't know. I want. I don't know if I want that close. <laughs> right, I don't know if I want the splash zone tickets. <laughs> right. Regular, just view it. I'll view from afar next time <laughs> when the bird show happens. <laughs> and you'd like to know when you're actually going to the bird show because you didn't even realize exactly. you were at the bird show. You need an update. <laughs> Jeez. We have a, a special creator event tonight at a different place called Harambe Market. Chickens get the kangaroo. <laughs> no, they don't serve kangaroo, Michael. <laughs> so keep funny. charging things. Yes. Okay. We'll stop. We, our phones are all running out of juice because we're posting so much, and filming so much, and sharing so much with you. We hope you guys are enjoying um, the content because we are certainly enjoying sharing it with you. This is crazy. So much fun. What an amazing party. my own gourmet chocolate mousse here. Oh my god. Look, gosh. TikTok colored chocolate sauce. We got a little chocolate mousse clump. We got Oreo bits and Pop Rocks. I mean, name something better. I mean, Your come on. Is gonna my mouth is going to explode. My mouth is going to explode. So this has been one of the coolest experiences that I've had in a long time. Um, we had this TikTok sponsored dinner, which is insane. <laughs> They're trying now. We're going to Pandora, and the park is opened just for us. So no one else is here except for the creators, which is crazy. First of all, second of all, sponsored by TikTok, crazy, crazy. And now we're gonna go ride Pandora by ourselves. 
which is insane. And also, I'm that's, really sad. Sure. I'm gonna hold it. What? Why can't I hold it? Because I'm holding it. Well, you can pass it. I can hold it just to well, say. Well, talk. Go ahead. You can talk. Well, you'll never know what I what I have oh, to say. Oh, All right. We'll see you guys curious. there. Ooh. I was like, oh, it's fine. Like, like, we have entered Pandora, and you can hear the animals, and you can hear, you can see all the lights. Look, look at, look at the floating islands. Wow. This is one of the coolest places to be at night. I mean, I've caught fireworks for one thing, this is another. Holy cow. Mike has never been on Avatar. Are you nervous? Okay, good. You shouldn't be, it's all good. All right, we are being linked to an Avatar right now in Flights of Passage. Yes. Great, flying on the back of this powerful animal called All right, Avatar, Katie, what'd you think? Um, my favorite part of the entire ride was when Dad goes, ooh, jellies. <laughs> And then he looks at me and goes, Jill, jellies. <laughs> oh, okay. They're not jellies. <laughs> no. They're not jellies. Well, they look like jellies. They yeah, look like jellies. It was jellies. so funny. And I heard him. And, he, and then in the beginning, he was like, whoa. <laughs> and he was like, like it was a horse. He was like, whoa. There. Yeah, whoa. My favorite part of the entire ride was listening to Dad's commentary. All right, so you you can sit next to him next time. Yeah, fly next to him. We'll put it that way. Kaden, what do you think? First timer. Uh, I know. First timer. I think it's amazing, and I always never un I never understand how they do all the. You know, I feel the water and everything. Right, 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 right. Disney yeah, is the is. master of putting you in the full experience. Is that what you just said? Yes. Ryan, what do you think? I thought it was as great as the first two times. And every time I notice a little detail, I mean, I always notice they pump like the smell of where it's supposed yes. to be. Yes, like the but mushrooms. Favorite, the mushrooms. Do you smell oh, the mushrooms? The mushroom my favorite. Is strong. That is strong. My favorite part of the ride is uh, is when it's like you're going over the cliff and you just go straight down. And it's yeah, so much fun. yeah. And then you land on like the edge. And you see the whole like ending thing, and uh, it's very fun. Very fun. And my favorite part of the ride is that we don't have to wait. All right. Anywhere. So we get to go again. again. Michael John, what do you think? Loved it. I like uh, that you can feel my um, my bird the, the thing. Ban Banshee. Breathing. Banshee my breathing. Banshee right. Breathing. It's so realistic, yes. right? Actually, I loved it more this time than I did the first two times because I didn't get nauseous. I same, like, same, same, yeah, same, same, same. I don't know same. why. I was prepping myself to get Me nauseous too. and I was like, I'm a little nervy. Like, I think I'm like I'm going to get nauseous. Nauseous at all. <laughs> so, let's <laughs> Let's do it again. Do it again. Run it back. Uh, what made me happy today? There, if I could pick one specific moment, and there's a lot of moments, but there was a specific moment where Ryan and I went and we went on that little trail that nobody really knew about, and I turned the corner and saw the tree of life. That was beautiful. So I would say that was like a specific like moment that was pretty cool. Michael, what made you happy today, baby doll? Well, thanks for asking, Chili. I loved getting up early and boarding the buses. I thought that was really cool and meeting a lot of cool creators. It was great. What made you happy today, Kaden? What made me happy was the amazing, amazing experience of... <laughs> it was so amazing, you forgot the, what I it's called. I know it's called. the Avatar ride. Flight of Passage? Yes. I'm just bad at the names. I'm bad at really? the names. Really? That's what, like, that was, that was that impactful? You loved it? Yeah, it's, it's amazing. And then also being able to, you know, go on it twice in yeah. 30 minutes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, that's amazing. That's, yeah. That was quite... It's like, a once, it's like a once in a oh. lifetime. It'll never happen again. What made you happy today, Katie Kate? It'd be a long day. Oh my gosh, I forgot. We, we saw tons to of giraffes. Today. I know, we saw tons of giraffes. Remember that too? Yes. And zebras? Yes. Kate and Bobby Marvel earrings. Too. No, he yes, did. Yes, he did. Um, Iron Man, Captain America, Captain Marvel, <gasps> um, Black Panther, this is Black Widow, and um, Hawkeye. And then this one is Thor. I don't know if you can see. 
I like a little hammer. Caden hid it underneath because he's trying to steal it from me so he can put it on a necklace. Ah. But it's, it's an earring, so. That but, is so cool. What made you happy today, Rod? Holy cow, Mom, what made me happy today? Hanging out at the pool with you and get a little bite to eat. We did some content. It was so much fun. And then having Pandora all, all to ourselves and just riding it. <laughs> and seeing everyone. We got to see all the creators at like the party. So much fun. And the dessert was crazy. So. <laughs> it was crazy. Anyway. Tomorrow's going to be another amazing day. I, I can't. I should just tell you, tomorrow is Epcot and there are some special oh, things planned, which I'm so excited about. I'm so excited. And we need we, to do that. Just a little hint, we started out in France and you guys know how we feel about France. We love France. Anyway. We love France. Okay. So thank you so much for watching. Comment down below what made you guys happy today. We hope you're enjoying following our Disney um, journey because mm -hmm. it has been so amazing. And we will see you tomorrow, guys. Stay tuned for tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be crazy. <laughs> Bye. For the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.